the following Slammy Award is perhaps the most prestigious of them all. This is the Lifetime No Show Achievement Award. <laughs> to be considered a no show, one must deliberately not show up to an event that they are booked for or morally, morally obligated to. The nominees for this category have aspired to continually not show up to matches, promos, practices, and even Hall of Fame ceremonies. <laughs> despite being obligated to do so. Scott Hall is a professional wrestler who is widely, who is widely known for his ability to no-show an event without giving proper notice to the booker. It's like a four-way tie for this. Therefore, it is with great pride that we dub this Lifetime No-Show Achievement Award the Hey Yo. <laughs> For this category are... Just the time this match is over. Four. Come on, Devil's Prophet. Five. We got five. Six. What the hell's going on? Seven. We got seven. Eight. Eight. Nine. Nine. Hello, Devil Prophet. Ten. Ten. That's it. Ring the bell. What? What does all this mean? Uh, you didn't do anything, let the rep come and get it. Come here, rep. Come get the belt. I guess we got... What a sham. What a, he just won the belt and he didn't even break a sweat. It's history for him. He just won the lot of title. I, I feel screwed. He just, he just won it. It's just... So what do you call yourself? Hey, I'm going to see you. They called it the Little Havana for the American dream the first day. And only one man in a million was hungry enough to pay. So what do you call yourself? Huh? Hey, Come on. Yeah. They called it the Little Havana for the American dream the first day. And only one man in a million was hungry enough to pay. Well, here it is. We got a casket match. It's Halloween Survival 3. And it's time. Where are you? 
Your yeah. boy in the back, he didn't show up. This next inductee, oh God. Yeah, that's what she said. Oh my God. This next inductee was actually the person who got me involved with wrestling. And I actually, in my earliest beginnings, was his bodyguard, if you would believe that. Of course, the day where he came to question me was his last, as I beat him in a last man standing there, yeah. victimized yeah. with lots of blood. One, two, three! Woo! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's actually how it went. Oh, last man standing. I apologize. <laughs> Canada. But this person, to me, for a lot of years, was viewed as the top of the mountain. But then something happened. With that mountain. All of a sudden, we realized that mountain was covered in snow. <laughs> and then his first trip, it was like a snowball effect. And as it went down, it kept getting bigger and bigger. Lots of pun intended. <laughs> Unfortunately, the man, you know the man I'm talking about is the centerfold Tony Cairo. Who? The centerfold Tony Cairo. Who? You know, calm like a bomb? Hey, yo. <laughs> oh, hey, yo. Gotcha. <laughs> Unfortunately, the centerfold was not able to attend tonight. That's so shocking. Bullshit. And the reason being is not bullshit. The reason being is unfortunately... He was unsuccessful in his attempt at passing the wellness policy tonight. Oh, 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 third time. Jesus. So that is strike three. I don't know what's going to happen here. but Well, if Commissioner Night Train was here, I think that the centerfold would definitely be getting the axe. They put him on SmackDown. Yeah. They were. That good night. Well, <laughs> I got to say, this is probably, there's probably two that stick out. Most to me, and probably to a lot of other people. Do I agree? <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah in this two. room. Yeah, in this room. Yeah. Um, let me think about. Yes. 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 So, with that really being said, it's really hard to declare a no-show champion. You see, Caro's been the no-show champion for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> He's actually been no-show champion since I I can't even remember. 2003. Yeah, probably. <laughs> But the fact is, there is a worthy adversary. So <laughs> like in 2000, you know what? All the world's a stage, and it's showtime. However, I feel like Cairo puts up a good fight. He's failed the wellness policy not once, not twice, but three times. He was actually let go, and then, you know, the higher power said, we're going to clean you up, we're going to send you away for a little bit, and... If you do community service, you can come back. Charlie, Charlie Sheen helped me out. Charlie's out. Winning! So, with that being said, Silver Valley it, Lodge. It's a, we're in a lock here. It's a two-man tie. Uh-oh. The centerfold Tony Cairo and Mr. Showtime. You guys earn this together. Yeah! Hard work. Hard work of Dodging Shows. You guys come up and accept this joint title Thank as you so are much. both co-champions. Really <laughs> <laughs> lifetime Achievement Award of not being there. How many years? Well, <laughs> lifetime No-Show Achievement Award. <laughs> the Hang No title. Being that this is my first title in EWA history, thanks a lot James and Denny. Uh, <laughs> Why you not winning? You know, because it's the bullshit he was fed. Oh, Gooch. Oh. No, high. not even by Gooch! Oh. Krieger. You know, it took a lot of uh, nights at restaurants like Portillo's and Buffalo Wild Wings and whichever thing else. Not IHOP! 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 And what's the real name IHOP? What does it really stand for? The International, remember that? Yeah, but I can't remember the. Yeah. The International House of Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, that was funny at the time. You know, I thought we were young. Yeah. That was eight eight years enough, ago. Ironically enough, the two people who actually get this. Are the two people who actually showed up tonight? Yeah. So, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> um, you always said you wanted a title. Yeah. There yeah. You go. And I'll, I'll, let you, I'll, I'll let you hold on to it. Oh, that's fancy. Cool. That's good in all, in all those countries on there. 
How is he Cuba? Not <laughs> 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 in that very country. Yeah, I wasn't there for the chair shot. But yeah, <laughs> hey, uh, thanks, and um, this one yourself. <laughs> this one an Iron Man award. So what the hell, hang on. Real quick, I'd like to also point out that both of these guys were the original tag partners of my good friend, Angelo Angephonic Armani Glitchio. <laughs> and they both ditched his ass. <laughs> I didn't ditch him, figuratively, but both of them decided to no show when it came to being his tag partner. Show the photo, show, show. <laughs> now, now, Mr. Armani. Dude, come on, come on up show. here for that, come on up here for that, yeah. <laughs> the group that never was. I didn't deserve this shit, the original hot <laughs> This prick had mono. <laughs> And he like died. It was in, legitimate. It was he, legitimate. He, like, right. he died in shit. policy failure. <laughs> this guy had movies. This guy ended up in a wheelchair. This guy ended up in a wheelchair because he slipped on a taco on the and severed his spine That's in three different up. places. <laughs> that was a But these guys show. these guys are pretty good guys, even though they both deserve that title. <laughs> you guys are pretty good. Congratulations, my friend. <laughs> Shit, how did you get a winner? It took 11 years. <laughs> but it was worth it.